Oh yeah, right. Yeah, the first door. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Juliana. <laughs> Will you go ahead and remove them from the list? Yeah, they have too much self-worth. They won't do what we need them to do. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, and Juliana sent them my next yeah, appointment. Thank you, Juliana.
used to work for Apple. Okay, that's fancy. Have you ever worked for like a, like a boutique or something? Like somewhere where you have to maybe like a car salesperson, like any like sales experience? No. Okay. Okay. <laughs>
that is not billable so that is completely on you and like I said it's just something that will build morale me and my husband we, we will also be on that schedule so once a week we me and my husband will also be the ones bringing you coffee and breakfast but it's also like a little team building experience everyone gets a little bit closer so typically if we're understaffed that week it'll be one person but typically it's two sometimes even three and you guys will split the cost of it but amongst you is that something that we're okay with okay just a question yeah um so yep after our morning meetings then we will have you clock in at seven o'clock and you'll sit down and we'll give you a list of companies and people that we want you to call out for our pharmaceuticals and then um you can either take your two 15-minute breaks or your 30-minute break and then at the end of your shift we also have a 30-minute after you clock out of course a 30-minute to catch up on things that we need to do better or you know just different things that are morale you know we're all about morale here um and again that is not billable that will be after you clock out because that is not a part of your job description um and so typically on a day you're working an extra hour that you're not being paid for but it's all in good morale how do we feel okay okay i'm not liking your answers here i'm not gonna lie okay Said 
MIT. All of that's really fine and dandy, you know, but we're really looking for someone that if I gave you this pen, you can sell it to me, you know, so your personality, I think we can work on that, but, you know, your experience is a little bit concerning, but, you know, it's neither here nor there. Um, again, how do we feel about background and drug test? Background checks, obviously, and drug test. Do we feel any type of way about that, or not a no problem? Okay, that's good to hear. We actually don't do any of that here, because, you know, we have a lot of, like, ex-convicts and, um, you know, drug users in the house, myself included. <laughs> Just kidding.
just spell that name off for me. And any relation or one of the boss, coworker, your sister. Okay, typically most places don't take references from family, but you know, I'm most likely not gonna call anyway, so it's fine. Like I said, you did okay. You did okay. You kind of started off a little bit sketchy and then you did kind of go to the middle and towards the end there, your answers were just not what we were looking for. But to be honest, none of the people that we have here are really all that qualified, so you're not that far off from them. Yeah. Um, so I think that's all we've got here for you. You did really well, and we're gonna go ahead and give you a call.